What's up, everybody? My name is Lewis Newsom. Uh, I am a proud Sabian endorser. I've been with Sabian for a little over 10 years. And a couple days ago, I got a box at my front door and I was eager to open it up, but I said, let's make this a family affair. And I wanted you guys to open this box with me so we can do an unboxing together. Um, so I'm not even gonna prolong this. Let's open this thing up and see what we got inside. I already cut it open, well, pulled it open, but I haven't checked to see what's in here. The box was just closed. I didn't want to take the time to uh, open it in front of you guys, so I already did half the work. Right. Ah, okay. Ah, this is the Tempest. This is the Tempest symbol. Yeah. Let this baby out. Okay. Yeah, this is um this is the Tempest symbol. I call it the symbol because you could either use it as a ride or a crash. And um I've always been a fan of the darker symbols, uh, because this is the HHX. And I've always, like I said, I've always been a fan of the dark symbols, the dark, dark tones. Um, the hammering on here is crazy. Um, so yeah, uh, let's put this on the stand and see what it sounds like. Yes, sir. Wow. Um, this symbol is going to be one of my favorites to start using now. Um, so a couple of things. Um, I noticed when 
I was swinging on it. Uh, it had great stick definition. Um, so that checks off the jazz uh, air, uh, genre. Um, and then I started digging into it a little more. Um, and what I noticed was uh, the attack wasn't jumping out at me um, as soon as I hit it. Um, it was a nice, warm, uh, tonal sound that I had to work up to to reach its peak, but it didn't take long to get to uh, the level of uh, loudness that it at, that it has. Um, so I really like that. You don't find that a lot in cymbals, so um, that also checks off the list for the rock section. Um, and what I find is um, you can use this cymbal in any genre, just about, uh, whether it be in a rock setting, jazz setting, um, church setting, uh, funk setting, uh, and I'll explain that too because I was nervous because of the bell. Uh, it's a little smaller than uh, my other rides. Um, so I was a little concerned, but it gives just enough bell um, to accommodate uh, the, the warmth uh, of the rest of this cymbal. Um, so I really enjoyed uh, kind of riding on the bell a little bit. Um, like I said, the stick definition is amazing. Um, I also feel that this symbol could be highly used in the symphonic orchestra genre as well. Whether you're leading into a chorus or coming out of a chorus or leading into the top of uh, a composition, um, this symbol is just all around uh, just A+. Plus. And I hope you guys grab this. Uh, this is the 22-inch Sabian Tempest symbol. You can't call it a crash, you can't call it a ride, um, because you can use it in any type of setting. Uh, so yeah, guys, make sure you grab this symbol. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, listening to it as much as I enjoy playing it. You guys have a great one. Peace.